Mark. Yeah, Chris Cole, Kiana, stick and move. Okay, so we're going to talk to you first, Chris. All right, UFC fit guy. What's that mean? UFC fit. So I got a chance to do, uh, they did a casting in L.A., huh. And it's actually funny that I missed the first casting. Okay. And by the grace of my agency, uh-huh. they were they didn't find what they were looking for. Okay. So they did another uh, casting, and I actually landed the role. They wanted those being, arms. They wanted the fighters. They wanted the fighters. You see, they love the movement. Okay. They love the arms. So okay. So what is a UFC fit guy? What is it? Your background is martial arts. Yes. Background: I was a professional athlete, football, okay. uh, f- professional football player, and then that kind of translated over to uh, naturally doing the martial arts. Okay, we found some of those pictures of you two. I think the UFC fit uh, the article in the magazine. There you are. Look at that. Okay, I love that one. Yeah, you know, a little nice. flabby, but whatever. Yeah, a little flabby. Okay, and then you, I mean, you do some pretty cool stuff. I and mean, what, what's that? Are you, are you pole vaulting? What's going on here? Yeah, it looks like pole vault. Right. Actually, we, we jumped on a trampoline in Malibu, California. We shot that. For men's health, so that was okay. So martial arts is your background. You're obviously uh, an athlete that can do some pretty extraordinary things. Today's workout, it's all about body weight, right? It's about body weight, body movement, and just being free of your expression, just expressing yourself. And so that's when we warm up. We we'll do the jinga because it's just a free movement. It's your movement. Bruce Lee has a principle. He says it best. Based on your own experiences. Uh-huh. Absorb what is useful, mm-hmm. add what is uniquely your own. In a dance. Add what is uniquely your own. In a dance or whatever. It's your movement. It's not to say a dance. People get hung up in the dance, but it's your movement. But here's the thing. People who can't dance get hung up on the dance. But it's your movement. Okay, so this it's is your expression. This is the warm-up, the Jenga. We're going to start it out. Okay. Show me what this okay. is. So this is a Jenga or whatever your movement. Now... My fitness model, she will be t- doing something totally different. Okay. She's going to do yoga side. Okay. So you're going to see her movement. That's her flow. That's her expression. Okay. This is my expression. My expression is the Jenga because I am a martial artist. Now I want to throw a kick. You know, now I want to throw another kick. That's my expression. This is just your warm up. Now I can go into the martial arts side of it. Okay. And then Kiana, behind you, her thing is yoga. So her thing is yoga. See, it looks a little more like yoga. Now, yeah. How about somebody who doesn't really have a thing? Keep going, keep going, keep going. You want to think? I don't really have a thing. I you, find you, find right you find it. You find it. You find it. Kick. It's your warm up. It's, it's, it's cardio I'm basketball. I'm basketball, right? So I'm just going to dribble the ball. Whatever. Whatever it is. Do it of a duration of one to three minutes. So I can do I can do a push up. It's your it's your expression. I can do a twist. It's your expression. It's I'm your expressing. expression. Okay. Whatever you want to express, it's yourself. You're free to express it. So whatever you want. I mean, because this is what I do. <laughs> but this is your expression. It's your, the what, reason, the, the what did Madonna reason, say? Express yourself. Ex- she did. She Express said Express yourself. See, the reason, see, you guys, it doesn't matter. You can do it too. If I can do it, I look like a silly man. There you go. Expressing myself. Okay. That's the warm up. We don't have one or three minutes for that. Let's do the first exercise where we got power lunges. Okay. We got power lunges. So we have a very, uh, we have a high intensity okay. and we have a low intensity. Can you please show them the low intensity first? It's for those ones who have plaguing knee injuries. I know we all been there. Okay. And now, Okay. Now show a high intensity. Because I know he's dying to do this one. Oh, okay. High intensity. You know, use the arms a little bit. So the high intensity is like this one. Oh, that's high intensity. Okay, there we go. So let me see that one. Let, okay, the high intensity. Okay. Down. Up. Yeah, use there your arms go. though. Put your arms in. Put my arms in. Right. Use your arms. This is my warm up. This is my jinga. Wow. Okay, we got to cut it short. We've got the second half of the workout nice. coming up. Nice. We're not going to do Jenga though. All right. Nice. Thank you. Thank you guys. Uh, Jill, over to you. All right. Give it part two. Uh, we got rid of the dancing. We're keeping the Taylor Swift. Chris Cole, Kiana. All right. You're a UFC guy. Fit. We saw some pictures. You can move. But we're going to bring this down so that anybody can do it. Anybody can do this. Okay. So what do you have for us? So now we're going to do high knees. Okay. So continue with the body. Yes, continue with the body, body movement. Keanu, uh-huh. go ahead and do the high knees form. Demonstrate that. Okay. It's simple enough. It's simple. It's simple. Now, what do you want to keep in mind? How high do you want your knees to go? Yeah, this is another cardiovascular type of training. Okay. It's just working your front best. And the thing about it is that you can keep your abs tight as well, your abdominal region. Okay, so why do you do that? Core. I mean, just make sure you have just, it. Just, just kind of keep that in mind. Okay. You know? 
And so next, I mean, you want to try it? Okay, okay, good. Right. You gotta do two so I can cheat off of you. Okay, you wanna land no. on, your, on your toes, on your heels? You can't, and you have great calves. Well, look, man, so, I a paper route, 10 years, uh, riding my bike. Mm-hmm. He's just like, shut up. Let me talk. All right, okay, on. okay, cool. So let's do punches and bunches. Uh -huh. This is a coordination drill. Coordination uh -huh. drill. Mm -hmm. So let's see your coordination. Mm -hmm. Punches and bunches. Okay. Can you demonstrate the punches and bunches? Okay, let me let me demonstrate it. Thank you, Keon. Let me let me demonstrate this right here. This is basically up and down. Right here. You're just throwing your hands and you're moving your right foot with your right hand, your left hand with your left foot. And you you know that's the problem. Huh? When you gotta match up the top and the bottom. So let's try. Let's so try. Let's see how this works. Okay. So let's go. Okay, so we're going right. Right. Yeah, it's like you're riding a bicycle. There you but go. But you're punching. Right. Just punching the air. We're not punching somebody. Right. We're, we're, we're being nice. Right. There you okay. go. Now, can I switch it up if I want to? Yes. Look at that. Coordination drill. Uh-huh. All right, now you would want people to do this consecutively. Yeah. You know, high knees and punches. High knees and punches and punches. And then what we will do is go off into a mountain climber. And do the mountain climber, the continue flow mountain climber, and then the pause mountain climber. Okay. Which really is isolating the abdominal region. So this is the continued flow. Mm -hmm. This is the continued flow. And you want to make sure when you're doing, when you're doing, let me let me demonstrate the the, the mountain climber. When you're when you're doing it, you want to make sure that your knees are hitting your elbow. So you want to, you really are starting to feel it in your abdominal, and then you want to. I feel to like pump. you're gonna start break dancing. Pause. Oh. <laughs> you're just gonna. You know? Okay. All right, so let's get down, show all my hands. Right. And then go up to my... Perfect. Whoa. That's perfect. <sighs> this guy is a natural. Uh-huh. Look at those arms. Oh, it took two hours to teach me this before. This guy is a natural. <laughs> okay, now this is the continual form. Uh -huh. Now that. pause. So lift lift up your left leg okay. to your, uh, your, 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 of course, your elbow. And now pause. Mm -hmm. And hold it for a second. Uh -huh. And bring it back. Okay. Bring it right up. Hold it. Bring it back. Now, Kiana, I'm... Interested to know why you're not sweating as much as I am. Yeah. <laughs> she glows. Yeah. Okay, so what's the pause do? It just isolates the muscle. It's like it's like kind of like a ballerina. Ballerina always do things slow, oh. and that's using all the fiber in the muscles. They call me a ballerina. Because if you do it, if you do it fast, anybody can just whip the right. whip a right. kick fast. Okay. But if you whip it slow, you're feeling all that pull. He's passionate. Yes. All right, Chris, that's all the time we got. What do we got throwing something at you? Okay, let's do, and we can also, if we have time, I would love to do a cleansing breath. What we do in Kundalini. Oh, real quick. Cleansing, cleansing breath. breath. Let's do it. What do we got? So we just do, we just do one cleansing breath. Do we'll just one cleansing breath, and we're clearing the mind okay. of everything. So we're inhaling, we're, we're breathing in the new, and on the exhale, we're taking out the old. Ready? And then exhale. And then respects. You always do respects. Oh yeah, I like respects. Right. And then we oh. use and use use it give a hug after five. I mean that's just we that's just brotherly love. We do a hug. Yeah. We just hug it in. <laughs> All right, look at those arms. Man. <laughs> We're done. We're gonna have all that info on myfoxytrade.com if you wanna see that. Bobby's trying to hand me scissors. Oh, cutting the sleeves. Off. Okay. So we got the guns. Okay, we're gonna do that. All right, uh, we are gonna head over to Dina.